And welcome to XCOM 2, War of the Chosen. It's been a while, but, well, truth is, I recorded a Dark Elf video today, and I started running it, I started running it, and then I realized that I hadn't pressed the recording button, and I moved like four or five turns ahead. And I'm like, no, and the worst thing is that I saved, so those, that episode, Totally lost. Thankfully, nothing of importance happened. You'll get to see it. Uh, you'll get to see the next episode tomorrow. But yeah, that was not pretty. So, did we have anything to do here? Eastern U.S. Make contact. Some stuff. No, we were getting some cash. Because there is no shame in admitting my admiration for your resolve in the face of insurmountable odds. I what? was born of battle, of a desire to face my enemies in combat and surrender to no one. In you, I see a shadow of my own creation. I take no satisfaction in battle with those who do not know it and would not seek it. But I am beholden to my master's will, and they would silence all questions. Okay, I... what is that? Monthly income is really decreased. Awesome. No, chosen knowledge of XCOM operations has increased. Oh. The Chosen are gonna do whatever it takes to get to you, Commander. Even if that means wiping out entire camps of resistance supporters. We're their only line of defense. So wait, what does that mean? The proving grounds are ready, Commander. We can build the Skulljack whenever you give the word. Cool. Welcome to the proving grounds, Commander. It seemed like a good idea to isolate some of our more experimental concepts, especially when it comes to weapons development. Yeah. Here's the Skulljack, but we don't have enough money. We could get some experimental stuff, though. Ah, you don't get these easy. Interesting. Okay, then. Covert Ops. Oh, right! Okay, fine. Let's send somebody. Well, Carol. And let's send Huan Yan Cheng. Go. Holy crap, they're on the other side of the world. Okay. Nice, nice, nice. And we need to find the Templars. Grade. And we don't have enough power. Awesome. Alright. Code action duration minus 33%. We need to uh, we need to keep clearing all that junk. Commander, I'm going to need more help on the engineering team before I can start clearing out some of these other rooms. We should recruit an engineer. That is it would be such a good idea. If only we could do it. Should recruit an engineer. Unused delirium cores, low intel, and power at capacity. Yeah, we have a lot of stuff. How do you recruit engineers? How do you recruit soldiers, to be honest? I never got around to asking you, Doctor, but uh, what exactly did you do before the invasion? At one time, I was employed as a biochemist in the pharmaceutical industry, mainly researching vaccine production techniques. Because of my background, I was rounded up by Advent and put to work in one of the very first gene therapy clinics. I saw firsthand what they're... I'd say we're lucky to have you with us. I appreciate the sentiment. I think you will find our results have exceeded expectations. Excellent. Excellent. What do we get? What do we get? This gives me some intel, right? Let's get some experiments. I will send word as soon as we have something of note. Good boy. 
Commander, we can now construct radio relays in any region where we've made contact with the local resistance. Good. I hate to ask, but it looks like I don't have much choice. Think you could help us out? Sure. What you got? Oh, it gives me an engineer. Yep, Setting totally doing that. For Western United States. All right, who do we send here? Vitaly, you're tired. Take a breather. You can take a breather too. Bradley. Okay. Let's see who we send. I'm tired, unfortunately, and I'm gonna be tired for three days. Send bro. Duncan. No, screw you. Wait, isn't that? Oh yeah, that's the. You know what? Let's fix her. I used to in my previous game. I had Bulldog. She was a. I think she was a... from the Netherlands. I think. Netherlands. Okay, and she was hard luck. What? Nah. Just give her some generic things. Okay, you can go away. Now, her name... Gosh, what was her name? I don't remember her name. <laughs> what are some Netherlands names? We'll figure it out later. It's just in the meantime. I'm gonna multitask like crazy here to check this out. Okay. Hair. She had long and wavy hair. And she was a redhead. Well, she was kind of a redhead, not really a redhead, but, you know, you get the point. So... Oh my god, they're multitasking. I don't remember what... Jesus, that's scary. Let's just go black. And what was her face? I don't know, this seems okay, but her face was different. Take that. Okay. There we go. Now, when I first recruited her, oh, oops. when I first recruited her, she had a full face on. She was, you know, you know let me find it. She was like this. No, wait, she didn't have a heart. She had a beanie. There we go. Was it? Shit, I don't remember. Her hair was not like this, though. That I can't remember. Right. Anyway, it was concealing her hair. She was captured. So... There we go. <clears throat> and as it turned out... Let's get rid of Van Damme. I had Van Damme. Why not? And as it turned out, she was captured and I rescued her. Right? Naturally, she got fucked. Not really, actually, not literally. But she got messed up in her cap days of captivity. Her face is, you know, it's not what it was. Okay. That looks okay. Now... Let's check out. First name. What do we got here? Eva Anna Sarasan. Tess Lynn. Like seriously, those are the names? 
Looks like Emma is a very popular name in the Netherlands. Julia. Sophie. Let's go with that. Let's go with Sophie. There we go. Lopez knew. We need a last name. Hang on. Netherlands last names. De Jean. What? Van den Berg. Wieser Schmidt. Uh, yeah, whatever. Schmidt. Done. There we go, Sophie Schmidt. The power of Google. It's incredible. Alright. Now, body, let's fix her up. Ooh, this looks nasty. You used to be pretty, and now you're not. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Now, when she came back, she is the very definition of a badass because she's pissed that the aliens got screwed her up so badly. She's the definition of a badass. Yeah. Let's go with these arms. There we go. Good job, Sophie. No, you'll be known as Bulldog, though. And let's give you desert. Let's make her desert theme. You know, that should be fun. Secondary colors already there. Classic. There we go. Tattoo, no tattoos. Tattoos are for wusses. In my universe, anyway. And let's give you a nice color. There we go. Weapon pattern. Classic. Natural. There we go. Pitbull's ready. We can upgrade her gun. We got the advanced air trigger. Nice. Might as well. Do we have any PCS? No, we don't. Bollocks. Alright. Pitbull's set. Now. Let's see what you guys... You're the Grenadier, so you got the guns. Pitbull, grab it. Actually... Two items. We still don't have a flashbang. Guy, keep the hot right. You... Damn it, you need the flash. We need a flashbang. We still cannot fill the flashbang if we don't have the money. Whoops. Press the wrong button there. So, right, then you grab the nano scale there. And you, my friend. Come on. Yes. We'll grab these. We're good. Let's go. Alex, please don't shoot my brother again. Menace, ready to deploy. Because for frack's sake. They're being asked to assist in a rescue operation for a resistance VIP currently trapped by Advent in the tunnels beneath the city center. I'm not sure what our target was up to, but the Resistance needs us to get him out of there. Hostile activity in the area is very likely, so keep your heads up. The tunnel's under San Francisco. Okay. We need to rescue somebody. Oh shit, there will be a VIP in this mission. Awesome. The Resistance VIP is hiding in the tunnels not far from your position. One of their field operatives is also on site to assist you in the rescue. Firebrand is standing by, but be careful. We'll have limited opportunities to set up a viable extraction point down there. Yeah, no kidding. Okay. Heading to that location. Let's go, Selfie Schmidt. Got it covered. Shh. Be very, very quiet. No need to ask twice. Our objective is not to kill everybody. Our objective is to get the VIP out of there. So that's what we're gonna do. 
Enseguida. Alright. Bro, move up. Alex, stick with him. Ten four. Move, move. <coughs> Snake. Movement ahead. Commander, remember, no matter how tough things get down here, we can't evac until we complete the mission. Oh, crap. Okay. Eyes on the prize. Long watch. Move. Good copy. Moving on target. We've got an enemy squad here. Overwatch. They're just outside. Okay, bro. Move up. Everybody on Overwatch. Go, 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 go. Let's do this. This stationary? You cannot hit shit from here. Which means you'll have to relocate. Go, go, go! Run. Looks like that patrol is not gonna be moving anytime soon. So let's take this opportunity and set up a little firing position. That's affirmative. What is. Oh. On over I watch. see, I see. Okay. Alright, bro. Estoy en Go up a smith. En there we go. Alex. You're flanked from there. From who? <sighs> Shit. I'm on the move. Crap. Got a snake. And it's coming this way. Is it gonna spot me? And there's a purifier with her with them too. Okay, we're in for a world of problems now. <clears throat> okay, Denise. You can make a glorious explosion. I'm going to overwatch. You don't have a grenade, so you go into overwatch as well. And you cannot throw long enough. Alright then. You're gonna take a shot. Take a shot at the snake. It'll reveal us, but... I mean, we can't do anything about that now. Ooh, nice! It was a crit, too. You are both terrible. You're both the worst. Okay, we're in trouble. We're in serious, serious trouble. Only my bro can do anything now. And that purifier. It won't kill him though. It will be so nasty though. Can we kill the snake? We cannot hope to kill the snake even if we stab it. Yeah, we should have run a gun. Okay. This is so dangerous. This guy is gonna flame on these two. Oh boy, here we go. Alex is in a bind. Watch the flame. And the flame guy is gonna burn you both. Oh, no, he just throwed. It. Yeah, he burned. Oh, yeah. Incendiaries in the in the flame. And that scumbag. Oh, he he wasted both of his stuff. And here comes the stun lancer. Ow.
second stun lancer missed. Oh, grab those two stun lancers. Okay. Take a shot. I know it sounds insane, but... Uh, I'll have to think about that. Actually, hang on. Let's go and stab the snake. Yeah, let's go and stab the snake. Nice. That should unbind Alex. There we go. Excellent. Which means that Alex can now move into some cover at least and shoot the snake. Nice. Excellent. And the snake is down and twitching. Now, as for you guys, you're fracked. I mean, it's not the way around it. You're really fracked. You need, some, you need to take cover. You guys really need to take cover. We'll do. Right, we will. <laughs> She's on fire. Pretty sure just because I built her now that she is going to die. Rolling. Let's keep a good spread. Why are you hunkering? Wait. Oh, it can put out my fu my the fire. Interesting. Now we need this purifier out. Face immediately. Because that Ready AOE drive. is just painful. All right. Let's see what happens. So mind control is only caught. Or panic. Now mind control. Okay. Okay, so my brother is taking close combat attacks like a champ. Like, Jesus. Look at that. Look at that. He's invulnerable. She's still burning. And she is burning. Okay, she's no longer burning. We can uh, do some damage to that stun lancer. Let's do it. Never mind. How the hell did your cover just got wrecked? Okay. Now my bro is yes, he's in a precarious position, which means he'll have to get out of there. There we go. And take a shot at the stun lancer. Ah, oh, that was not a crit. That's unfortunate. And Alex. These guys are melee, so it doesn't really fracking matter. Roger that. So let's just go there. Shoot at this guy who's been damaged already. Okay, cool. We unfortunately cannot help Lollipop yet. It sucks. What the hell? Oh, right. No respite for the dead. The aliens have found a way to mind control them now. What the frack? How much health does that zombie got? My brother is just a straight up lucky guy. There's no other way. There's no other way to explain it. Crap! Bastards using up my grenades. Pitbull is screwed. She's royally screwed. But we need those stun lancers out of the way. Size up. Forty-three percenter. Yes, you're flanked, but. I'm giving this way too much time to develop and do damage. Damage that I cannot afford right now. We can get rid of a stun lancer. Or we can do some serious damage to this guy. Let's do some serious damage to this guy. There we go. Good shot. 
Nice, solid damage. And as for Alex, you, my friend, I'm gonna go here. I know what you're gonna say, I'm putting you in harm's way, but everybody's in harm's way at this point. Ah, this guy's running away. And he missed. Look at my brother go. Ah, I spoke too soon. But still, holy crap. And she is going to shoot Alex. She's gonna. Oh, God, last mate. Damn it. And the zombie is gonna attack my bro again. Ow. We'll be fine. Oh, thank God. Mind control's out. Which means we can get some flanking fire on this guy. Perfect. Revenge. God, I need flashbangs so badly in this game. You cannot, because you are disoriented. Brothers kind of in, pro in trouble. We need to heal him. Combat prot, aid prot. You can only reload, huh? Heading to that location. This might heal my brother, please. He will need all the health he can get. Good. And you can target only the size zombie. It's not a good shot. Okay, head over there. Another bug that you're still on fire. Let's shoot the stun lancer or the sectoid. Sectoid. It was a long shot, but going to Overwatch would have been pointless because it would have been sucked up by other people. Oh, nasty. He's going after me, bro. This stun lancer is not having a good day. And the zombie is going after me, bro, once again. Please miss. Great. Awesome. My brother died. That's actually terrible because he had the most damage output right now. Alright. Crap, we need to reload. Seriously? My heavy damage dealer needs to reload. Out of the way. Mother. Right. You can shoot at this. You cannot shoot. You need to reload. What about you? It's a long shot. It needs to be taken. Nice. Good job, Pitbull. And because she, the sectoid's dead, this guy's dead too. Ready to engage. Orders confirmed. On the move. Frack. I'm sure the docs will want to see this. And he's dead. He's not even disoriented. He's just died. God damn it. He didn't have anything useful, did he? Orders confirmed. Moving out. Well, luck had to run out eventually, I guess. I will say that he had a pretty good run, though. He took so much damage, he tanked it like a champion. Like, seriously, that was impressive. Now, if I had a flashbang, this would have been so much simpler, because I would just would have flashed the bloody sectoid, and the mind control would have been solved. Copy, and that target. zombie wouldn't have killed me, bro. Looks like they called in some friends. We got the VIP in tow. Moving the VIP evac. identity confirmed. Firebrand is setting up for evac. We've got multiple contacts closing on your position. It's an ambush. Hold your ground. Crap. We're so out of position right now. Okay. Solid copy. You need some long. You need to get some long shots in. Heading to 
that location. Right then. Open the door. Go into the door. You keep your head. You keep your head down. Should have put you there. You only have one action yet. Go into the watch. Here we go. It's three turns. It's three bloody turns. <clears throat> Okay, so we got more sectoids. Awesome. And a trooper. And we're gonna have a sectoid and a trooper. I should not have selected that option. It gives everything more health. I'm being punished. There's more! Oh shit, son. Okay, you go and kill the watch. Do we have any grenades? No. Alright, pitbull. Why can't you flank the bastard? Oh, there you go. You can. Go. He's such a piece of move right now. But we need the sector to die. Okay. Did some damage to him. Okay, they're gonna focus her down. Hunker. You know, I'm very afraid that he's gonna bloody mind control my guys once again. Good to do Jack. There we go. At least he's dead. More of them coming. What the hell? Plow. Good shot. Okay. Let's see what do we got. This looks a little ugly. Ow. That was a nasty hit. He missed because he's a dumbass. Got more incoming. Damn, I need this sectoid to go away. Moving to position. That's my problem right now. That's sectoid. Shot. Pitbull might die here. I'm not joking, of course she, she's dead already. And I wasted more both of my grenades. Moving to position. Good news is... Sectoid, sectoid is out of the way. Good job. Nailed him. I'm all out. You hunker. Jesus, there's so many of them. See what these guys do. Okay, he's shooting at the VIP. He missed. I'm all right. Oh my God, I'm such an idiot. And he's gonna flank Pitbull. And she's dead. Oh, oh she's bleeding out. Here. We can actually save her. Jesus, there's more coming. Get out of there before things get any worse. We've picked up a lull in their forces. It looks like they're running out of reinforcements. Let's get moving before that changes. All right. Moving to designated coordinates. No, stay there. VIP needs to get out of there. Like, she's the first that won that needs to get peace out. She's super, super... VIP secure and in position Firebrand for Firebrand has the VIP. Time to get the rest of the squad out of there before they get overrun by those damn things. Grab her. I've got gotcha. you. 
she can still move. Unfortunately, she's moving to designated of... position. All right, getting to cover. That, I mean, my legs would have been broken right there. Okay, Alex, you have to stay there. You really have to. You have no other choice. Soak up some fire. Admin troop spotted. Yes, I'm using you as a bullet sponge. Probably it will. It will probably get you killed. Overwatch. Great. I'm gonna have to take a shot then. That's a lot of Overwatch. Shit, that, looks... that was a crit. Ow. Alex, he's good. He's good. He's okay. We can get rid of one of the Overwatch with combat protocol. By killing one guy. Okay, go. Yes? Alright. Overwatch removed. It usually removes it. Alright, Alex, get out of there. All right, let's do it. Heading there now. I hope it doesn't kill me. It's only one Overwatch. Let's see how much damage we can take. Three. <laughs> Woo! Damn. She Just got out. Time. All surviving XCOM operatives are secure. Firebrand returning to base. That was a nasty mission. That was a very nasty mission. Fired to him. Yeah, my brother died. God damn it. Advent would like to assure all citizens that despite recent attacks and loss of life attributed to radical fringe elements, our peacekeeping forces continue to put your safety and security before <coughs> all other priorities. Did I say that I need flashbangs? I think I mentioned it. Nasty mission. Really nasty mission. Revival protocol. Haywire protocol. Okay. Long watch. And you and Lollipop apparently are really good. Alright then. Yes, you're welcome. That was a nasty mission, bro. Ooh, boy, did Advent get their asses kicked today <laughs> or what? Our ever vigilant friends went through resistance, took a big old bite out of our alien overlords, leaving an untold number of invaders slaughtered in their wake. It's always a good day for good news. Whatever. That was it. Oh, Jesus, that was nasty. But that's how it works. We were on the middle of getting some supplies, eh? Let's finish getting these supplies and then I'll wrap this up. Message coming through, Commander. Putting it on screen now. I had high hopes for the resistance under your leadership, Commander, and you have outdone yourself. Yeah. Our friends in the Resistance have shared what they know of these so-called Chosen the Elders have sent after us. It sounds like we should expect these things to actively hunt us until we take them out. Time is not on your side. It won't be long before I find you, Commander. Hmm. Oh. 
nice, nasty. And you before hunts the Avenger. What's that? Huh. Okay. The aliens have just finished a new facility tied to the Avatar project, Commander. If we can make contact with resistance forces in the region, uh -oh. we could move on that facility and set back the aliens' work. Commander, we've just received intel that one of Dr. Volan's escape test subjects is guarding a nearby Advent facility. Best be prepared before we try to take it out. The cooperation of these extremists will do little to unite the forces of your resistance, Commander. Come on! The aliens continue to make progress on the Avatar project. If we're going to slow them down, we'll need to move fast. Finally, I got some money. And this episode is coming to a close. Jesus, that was, a, that was wrecked there. But not as bad as the last time, right? I'll catch you later, folks.